All right, downtown Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. It's actually very clean. I haven't seen one homeless person yet. Anyway, it's super sad too. Like that's pretty gnarly right there. This is the uh, National Monument. I'll be crossing the street in a second. I don't know, but I think that's Jesus. He's slowly walking on water. Wow, that's kind of crazy. Jesus lives in Oklahoma City. All right, this is the entrance. Looks like maybe that's where the old building used to be. Something, I don't know. So I guess they left pieces of the building here. Correction in my prior reporting. Yeah, that wasn't Jesus. It was a maintenance guy. It's not very deep. Gotta say I'm a little disappointed though. All right, so total bummer. The little chairs are for the kids who died. I think in the, um, there was a child care center on like the second floor or something. What a shame. So Every this right here, these trees are where the, the front of the building yeah. was. So I guess let's start with the reflecting pool. The reflecting pool was Northwest 5th Street. The street used to run all the way through in 1995, one-way street that went to the east. And the building that was targeted that day was everywhere where you see a pine tree or grass, nine stories. I always like to tell people that's a seven-story building with that slanted roof. Um, you know, 17 different federal agencies inside of here. The, Plaza was the original front door of the building. The middle flagpole with the American flag, there's gonna be a seal right underneath that that marks where the south door used to be, where you would come in as a visitor to any of the business of government. Two buildings across the street where that grassy area is right across from us, that was the water resource board building, three stories tall. Where the pathway is, if you were to straighten out that pathway, that was basically where the Athenian building was, smaller brownstone building got a cafe and an office inside of it. The grassy area going beyond the pathway where those terraces are around that tallest tree on the hill was the parking lot where it had about 80 car spaces, open lot. The Journal Record building is that seven story building there with a the slanted roof and houses our museum and some private offices there on the right side. Uh, there was a YMCA across the street where the gray building is now that gray parking lot used to be that YMCA there was a daycare there this side of the building where he parked the truck and he parked four trees down from where I am this side was all mirrored glass going up from stories two through nine so very susceptible to a bomb oh. where are you from uh Grand Junction Colorado okay so and these are the five that were outside of the building that's correct so we had three people pass away in those two buildings across the street, one on the sidewalk. The very first chair there belongs to a rescue worker who passed away four days after she was injured inside. And the little chairs are for the little kids. That's correct. There's 19 total smaller chairs right there. 15 of them were from the daycare, which took up the entire second floor of the building. Three children here were getting new social security cards. They're gonna be on the front row. And the fourth chair was bring your daughter to work day. So. Oh. All right, so this tree here is where dude over there said that he, he parked the truck. But man, it was so brutal. It like destroyed buildings and shit over there and killed people. Wow. So this is where you would go in and drop your kids off for daycare or whatever. But this was the second floor. Big tree right there in the middle is the survivor's tree. It was like a really big deal. It didn't get wasted in the explosion, so it became like this centerpiece of hope and such. Damn. This is the rescuer's orchard, something like that. Oh, there used to be a building that was here and it was too damaged, had to be torn down. But I think the blast was so huge, it actually killed three people in this building. It's 
So that's what the front of the building used to look like. That's where all those trees are in the grass. That's the reflecting pond right there. It used to be a road. It goes through there. And there's the two buildings that got knocked down. And attend that board meeting and uh, present your information directly to them or arguments directly to the nine-member board. Uh, they generally meet the second Tuesday of every month. Uh, so you'll be advised of that. Uh, with regard to this proceeding, basically there are four elements that I have to uh, uh, receive information regarding <laughs> It's a pretty cool little display, man. All right, that was the museum. That was a special kind of depressing. Fuck. Holy cow. All right, let's go find something fun to do.